Kansas City, Mo. Mati Stiebel hit five three pointers and scored 19 points, Jalen Nowell added 15, and Washington led most of the way in upsetting second ranked Kansas 74 65 on Wednesday night. Noah Dickerson added 13 points and 14 rebounds for the Huskies, 7 2, who knocked the Jayhawks, 7 1 from the ranks of the unbeaten with their first victory over them since December 1974. Lajrold Vict had a career-high 28 points for Kansas, doing almost all his damage in the middle of the Huskies' 2-3 zone. Graham, coming off back-to-back 35-point -back outbursts, was held to three points on one for eight shooting, while Mikhailiuk was three for 12 from the field and scored eight points before fouling out. The Jayhawks should have been prepared for Washington coach Mike Hopkins' zone defense, considering he spent 22 years on Jim Boheim's staff at Syracuse and Kansas had recently beaten the Orange. Vic got going again inside and as a buke slam of an alley-oop pass trimmed their deficit to 53-52 with nine and a half minutes to go. The Huskies calmed back down after a timeout, though, stretching their lead again. Thibel got loose for a transition dunk, Dickerson added a slam of his own, and Hamair Wright's three-pointer from the wing made it 69-56, their biggest lead to that point. Even when the Jayhawks caught a break, like a technical foul on David Crisp in the closing minutes, they couldn't capitalize. Graham missed both free throws with a chance to cut into a 73-59 deficit, and Mikhailiuk proceeded to a miss of three-point attempt as the Huskies put the game away. Big picture. Washington sure didn't look like the team that struggled to put away Seattle, California, Davis, and Omaha in recent weeks. The Huskies were clearly amped up to play the first of back-to-back -back games against premier programs with Gonzaga on deck next. Kansas might want to reconsider games at Sprint Center. While the Jayhawks like giving their guys a taste of the building, where the Big 12 tournament is played, it comes at the expense of a massive home court advantage in Allen Fieldhouse. Up next. Washington begins a four-game homestand with 0.12 Gonzaga on Sunday night. 